Yeah, <laughs> we are being reminded to uh, silence our phones and preferably turn them off. I've heard if you have your phone on in the past, we've had, and it rings, you get to come up here and do I'm a little teapot, <laughs> complete with all the body motions. So it's wonderful. Thank you all for coming today. I uh, just do a little bit of introduction and want to thank you. This activity is made possible by the voters of Minnesota through a grant from the Southeastern Minnesota Arts Council, thanks to a legislative appropriation from the Arts and Cultural Heritage Fund. So thank everybody, you all, for extending arts to our community to be able to host this wonderful event. Thank you for coming and gracing us with your presence. And it's my pleasure to introduce our MC tonight, or this afternoon, and have uh, Tom Overly join us. He'll be joining us with some solos and joining us in some song, and he's our, our MC. So thank you, Tom. All right, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Welcome to the Rochester Mail Chorus's 93rd annual Christmas concert. Has it really been 93 years? Ufta. A jazzy Christmas. A jazzy Christmas. It is fitting then that along with the chorus, special guests will be Nathan's Jazzers, featured with the chorus and two sets of their own during the program. But first, the Rochester Mail Chorus singing, It's the Most Wonderful Time of the Year.
So Christmas music has been in existence since the third century in forms of chants, carols, folk music, community songs, okay, taverns, maybe some bar melodies. Most early texts centered around the Christ Mass and were religious in nature, even in the taverns. Carols were popular in the 18th and 19th centuries, not necessarily in the churches, and were actually banned from some churches. Well, a change began to evolve in the 19th century. Songs like Jingle Bells were written, stories like Charles Dickens' A Christmas Carol, and poems like A Visit from St. Nicholas. They became popular, and Christmas celebrations moved secular, and Christmas traditions turned commercial. Well, jazz didn't make the scene until, obviously, a little later, the 20th century, and with the invention of vinyl recordings, radio, motion pictures, and television, the secular, popular Christmas season really exploded. New songs, new Christmas characters and songs featuring those characters were created, and the commercialization of Christmas took off, really took off, perhaps even out of control. Well, jazz covered both religious and secular Christmas songs with amazing arrangements and new melodies. Jazz music musician Vince Draldi created the soundtrack of Charles Schultz's A Charlie Brown Christmas in 1965 that resonates today and with the Christmas Time is Here and a jazz arrangement of 1834's German carol O Tannenbaum. Christmas time is here Happiness and cheer Fun for all that children call Their favorite time of year Snowflakes in the air Carols ancient rhymes of love and dreams to share.
The singer Mel Torme, also known as the Velvet Fog, gave us the unforgettable The Christmas Song, or more famously, Chestnuts Roasting on an Open Fire, a song recorded and performed by hundreds, if not thousands, of artists. It was done with the definitive version of Nat King Cole back in 1961. And the Rochester Mail Chorus is going to give you their 2023 rendition.
like that rendition, the 2023 rendition, right? So we are happy now to return the program over to the local jazz group Nathan's Jazzers for a set of Christmas songs from their huge repertoire of tunes. Uh, they play all year around throughout southeastern Minnesota. And uh, every once in a while on the Eagles Cancer Telethon on KTTC, and I understand I'm sad to hear you won't be part of the telethon this year, but there's kind of a big celebration, right? And at that is what? My mother's going to be 100 years old this year, January 14th. Whoa. So, yes. <laughs> but I was thinking, you know, maybe you could go have cake, celebrate with your mom. I could maybe pull a few strings. I know a few people with that telethon, you know, and maybe get you over there. Maybe not. Okay. Wish your mother a happy birthday on that day. All right. So uh, we look forward to uh, seeing them perform throughout the year as well. And again, an appearance here with us, the Rochester Mail Chorus. Ladies and gentlemen, Nathan's Jazzers. The snow is snowing, the wind is blowing, but I can weather the storm. What do I care how much it may storm? I got my love to keep me warm. I can't remember a worse December. Just watch those icicles start. What do I care if icicles fall? I got my love to keep me warm. Off with my overcoat, off with my glove. I need no overcoat. I'm burning with love, my heart's on the flame grows higher so i will weather the storm what do i care how much it may storm i got my love to keep me warm Thank you very much. You will recognize this next tune. You can embrace your inner Elvis. Won't be the 
the same dear if you're not here with me and when those blue snowflakes start falling that's when those blue memories start calling you'll be A picture print of career and eyes. These wonderful things are the things we remember all through our lives. They bells jingling, ring ting tingling too. Come on, it's lovely weather for a sleigh ride together with you. Outside the snow is falling and friends are calling you. Come on, it's lovely weather for a sleigh ride together with you.
together with you. Thank you, thank you. Nice job. All right, so the pop scene has also been added now to the enormous Christmas song catalog by a lot of different artists. And uh, this afternoon, the chorus showcases music from Stevie Wonder, Jose Feliciano, and Louis Armstrong, and the most popular Christmas song of all time from the pen of Irving Berlin and the iconic pipes of Bing Crosby, White's Christmas. Christmas magic, oh, why can't it be everlasting? Like the sun that always shines, like the poet's endless rhymes, like the galaxies in time. Christmas pleasing. Oh, why can't it be never leaving? Like the day that never fails Like on seashores there are shells Like the time that always tells It holds the key to every heart Across the universe It fills you up without a bite And quenches every thirst So If it's special Then with it why aren't we as careful is making sure we dress in style Posing pictures with a smile Keeping danger from a child It holds the key to every heart Across the universe it fills you up without a bite and quenches every thirst. So, Christmas magic, why can't we make it everlasting? Like the lifetime of the sun. It will leave no heart undone For there's enough for everyone
Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Prospero año de felicidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Prospero año de felicidad. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas.
I'll try there. Who there's an eye there? That you, Santa Claus? Is that you? him all right The Rochester Male Chorus came to KTTC and uh, performed on our four o'clock show, Midwest Access, and they p performed that song, Zat You, Santa Claus, and we never, for whatever reason, got to hear the ending of that, so I'm glad that it really was Santa and not a burglar or something. So, solved the, the riddle, the mystery. It's good to hear. 
All right, more music by Nathan's Jazzers, and true to form of the jazz musicians. We have no idea what they're going to perform next. <laughs> the Jazzers have selected their songs, but also true to form of jazz. They have no idea what, will, what muse will inspire their arrangements from show to show. So once again, Nathan's Jazzers. You better not cry, better not pout, I'm telling you why Santa Claus is coming to town He's making a list, checking it twice Gonna find out who's naughty or nice Santa Claus is coming to town You better not cry, better not pout, I'm telling you why Santa Claus is coming to town Definitely a favorite of mine and hopefully a favorite of yours as well. Made famous with Judy Garland. I think you'll recognize it. Christmas future is far away. Christmas past is past. Christmas present is here today. Bringing joy that will last. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Let your heart be light. From now on, our troubles will be out of sight. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Make the Yuletide gay. From now on, our troubles will be miles away. Here we are, as in olden days, happy gold. Gather near to us once more. Through the years, we all will be together. If the fates allow, hang a shining star upon the highest. A merry little Christmas now. Mm -hmm. 
all will be together if the fates allow hang a shining star upon the highest bough and have yourself a merry little Christmas now. Thank you. Before we do our last number, uh, Noah Short is on the drums this afternoon. He came up from Winona just to play with us, by the way. Steve Sawyer and I play together quite a bit from Rochester. Dan Ringstorff plays a lot, spent his whole life playing. He's going to continue on playing with, with us, I think. The lovely Linda Tyson, she's the vocal director in, in Plainview. So thank you to Joel for having this group. Uh, Joel's done some favors for me playing. He's a wonderful jazz piano player, by the way, besides being a great singer. And he's helped us out a few times. So thank you, Joel, for having our group. We're going to end with Holly Jolly. Jolly Christmas, it's the best time of the year. I don't know if there'll be snow, but have a cup of cheer. Have a holly jolly Christmas, and when you walk down the street, say hello to friends you know and everyone you meet. Ho, ho, the mistletoe. Once for me, have a holly jolly Christmas, and in case you didn't hear, oh by golly, have a holly jolly Christmas this year. <laughs> Again, Nathan's Jazzers. So most popular music, while secular in lyric and meaning, captures all the joy and celebrates the nature of Christmas. But the true meaning of the Christmas season comes from the Christmas story, the birth of the Messiah, Jesus Christ. A sermon in a set. Here is the Rochester Mail Chorus, telling the story in song and narrated by Ted uh, Keeker. prayer. Come, peace of God, and dwell again on earth. Come with the calm that hailed thy prince's birth. Come with the healing of thy gentle touch. Come, peace of God, that this world needs so much. Break every weapon forged in fires of hate. Turn back the foes that would assail thy gate. Where fields of strife lie desolate and bare, Take thy sweet flowers of peace and plant them there. Come, blessed peace, as when in hush of eve God's benediction falls on souls who grieve, as shines a star when weary day departs. Come, peace of God, and rule within our hearts. Amen.
And Zechariah was filled with the Holy Spirit and prophesied, saying, Blessed be the Lord God of Israel, for he has visited and redeemed his people and has raised up a horn of salvation for us in the house of his servant David. As he spoke by the mouth of his holy prophets from old, that we should be saved from our enemies and from the hand of all who hate us, to show the mercy promised to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant, the oath that he swore to our father Abraham to grant us that we, being delivered from the hand of our enemies, might serve him without fear in holiness and righteousness before him all our days. And you, child, will be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his ways, to give knowledge of salvation to his people and the forgiveness of their sins because of the tender mercy of our God, whereby the sunrise shall visit us from on high to give light to those who sit in darkness and in the shadow of death, to guide our feet into the way of peace. This is how the birth of Jesus, the Messiah, came about. His mother Mary was pledged to be married to Joseph, but before they came together, she was found to be pregnant through the Holy Spirit because Joseph, her husband, was faithful to the law and yet did not want to expose her to public disgrace. He had in mind to divorce her quietly. But after he had considered this, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream and said, Joseph, son of David, 
Do not be afraid to take Mary home as your wife, because what is conceived in her is from the Holy Spirit. She will give birth to a son, and you are to give him the name Jesus, because he will save his people from their sins. All this took place to fulfill what the Lord had said through the prophet. The virgin will conceive and give birth to a son, and they will call him Emmanuel, which means God with us. When Joseph woke up, he did what the angel of the Lord had commanded him, and he took Mary home as his wife. But he did not consummate their marriage until she gave birth to a son, and he gave him the name Jesus.
So Christmas by itself doesn't tell the entire story, a story that climaxes with Easter, God becoming human to restore relations with the human race. For now, we celebrate the Christmas season and sing with the angels in Luke 2, glory to God in the highest and on earth peace to all people. We conclude this afternoon's program with a song titled, Peace, Peace. And the chorus invites all of you to sing along with a stanza of Silent Nights. And thank you so much for coming this afternoon. singing silent nights.
Merry Christmas, everyone. Have a wonderful afternoon and a wonderful and blessed Christmas season.